Good morning, everyone. This is a presentation of a new working group on which LACNUC is working. This was proposed a short time ago and has organized a regional meeting And the inter I'd like to note that the chairs are Marcela Aviscal and the co-chair is Tracme Citero, who presented a proposal to create this working group. And this with a due justification that I will now explain. Now, what is universal acceptance? This is a principle, the principle of accepting, validating, and storing the domain names and special characters generated through the different languages. It is also about respecting the symbols of every language in the systems we use through the Internet. For example, acceptance is about accepting the domain which was set up through releasing the top domain levels as well as all the special characters. So our applications should be ready from the outset to accept all these characters and then go over to the validation stage to verify that the or accept that the syntax of that symbology is correct. So this also has to do with storage, storage of this information with the special characters as well as having the capacity to process all this information to then reach the visualization stage for the end user without changing the special characters. The purpose of this working group is to create a community concerned about improving the way in which the domain names and email addresses are assimilated and connect, including multilingual characters. This implies all the symbologies inherent to each of the languages. So do, how do we intend to achieve this? This is sharing learning experiences, generating best practices on the universal acceptance in the technical community through organizing and supporting training activities on universal acceptance and to generate a repository of documents on universal acceptance. In order to open this working group, we already organized an activity on the day declared as the day of the global universal acceptance. This was a hybrid event which was held on March the 30th and the 31st. There were five in-person hubs in Colombia, El Salvador, Mexico, Argentina, and Bolivia. We organized two panels with reference with ben people who with experts from the community, and we also organized three practical workshops. The target public are application developers because they are the ones who will be promoting this acceptance. We had network operators, services administrators, students, and university professors. At this event, we had a very wide participation from the academia, followed by the government, technical communities, private sector, and civil society. The country with the largest number of participants was Mexico. Mexico was followed by Bolivia and El Salvador. What are the following steps of this working group? In the October event, we are planning to organize a hackathon with experts for the laboratories so that we can work with email services and DNS services specifically to have a welcome kit for all the new participants to count on to be present in the technical activities of the region. For example, LACNOG is a wonderful space for this, the NOG meetings mentioned by the previous speakers, and to take these communities as well as on-demand training activities. So this working group will be paying attention to the training needs required by all your communities and also specific training for things that you might ask. 
This is based on the fact that we have had a wide acceptance of this day of the universal acceptance. And through a survey, we tapped your perception of the event. During this event specifically, we issued a certificate, and this can also be replicated in future activities. And here we see a, pictures of the hubs we have had. So we invite you to join this working group. This is LACNOG's web website, where you will find the link to join us. And we have a Discord group. So hopefully, we'll be able to generate much more activities for the coming stages. Thank you very much. Thank you, Leah. We will now continue with the presentation by John.